the data center. Uh, the floor is all under construction, but I'm here. I want to connect one of the switches to the distribution switch, which is right here. So to do that, I'm going to use that port inside here with this um, SFB transceiver. You can see the SFB 10 gig SR, which is a fiber SFB. I will insert this right here. And I already ran the cable from the patch panel. See one of the lights over there, and I will plug the cable in. Fiber patch panels are something like this. You go to each of the floors, they run upstairs, downstairs, and they come here, and then I patch them into the distribution switch. So the, the access switch will have uh, a connection. So this is the new floor after construction. We have lots of cables coming from the communication rooms. Uh, this is downtown Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. And have some access points installed. They're not powered up yet. I'm gonna go back to the comm room and connect the switch to the distribution. So this right here is a comm room. This is the closet. And I, I mounted the switch. Just uh, one switch for now. I always like to uh, take the door off. Take the sides off. So it can be easier if you want to hold it. Hold it up from here while I uh, mount the screws. And now I power the switch up and this is the fiber connection. This is the fiber patch panel that is coming from the second floor server room where I was. So you patch the cable and there is another another path actually. We will use that later when I connect the other switches. So the switch is up and running now. I can connect a a laptop and make sure, make sure if uh, it is up. And now I will connect the fiber cable between here and the distribution. And I don't see any lights. What happens sometimes is uh, we have to flip these two pairs. I can take out this white part and flip the pairs. Let's try that. So basically just like that. One is for transmit and one, one is for receive. I flip them and I'll try to connect it again. Okay, so I'll try to... Put them in. Oh. Okay. Let's see, and I have a light. The link is up. I can check here on the switch. 113 was not connect. I can show interface status again. I can see it's suspended. And I have a connection to a distribution switch. Also, it says it's connected on this side. Suspended, okay, I can show either channel summary or channel 78. I will try to do a shutdown and then no shutdown. right here 
Okay. Let's see. Suspend it again. Okay, so I did a show a quick show command for the interface, uplink interface here. Everything looks good. On the distribution side, I don't know why the physical interface does not have the channel group uh, command. So I will do that real quick. Interface. Channel group. Uh, 78. Mode. Active for LACP. And I want to do a shutdown. Shut. Let's see. Channel summary. This guy. W. What is the W? Waiting to be aggregated. Okay. Give it some time and now it's P, that means it's bundled in port channel, just like it says here. Let's see here. Uh, show connected. Ether channel summary. Okay, and uh, it's bundled as well. Now I have a connection. This is the link is green, it's blinking, it's up. And now this active switch is connected to the network. I can start patching cables, but as you see, the floor is still empty. No furniture, no computers yet. I will uh, bring the other switches later and I will have this stack ready. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments.